so now this is your command prompt from the command prompt what you need to do is uh, uh, depending upon uh, what type of pssc you have let's say if you are uh, having uh, installed version pssc 33 34 and 35 it means that you will be having two python environment one will be python uh, 2 and the other will be python 3 so if you have something like this um, uh, no problem uh, both python environments can coexist so first of all we will start with how to access pssc using a python version 2 so for this purpose within command prompt simply write pi minus 2 so and when we press enter we will enter into python uh, 2 so because uh, my installation is uh, 33.12 so for 33.12 uh, the pre-installed python is 2.7.18 and depending upon the version you have your python will it can vary from 2.7.8 or mine to 2.7.18 it doesn't matter that uh, the steps are same so the first thing uh, we need to do is we need to you know, request uh, to libraries which are important so uh, in python if you want to import any library you have to uh, or call any library you have to use import so import it something uh, like hash include uh, within your c so uh, what i will do is i will import os and sys these two libraries so the next time i am going to do is i am going to define my pssc path so i am going to create a variable with the name of pssc and the root directory or the complete directory of this is going to be within my C drive, my wherever my PSSC is installed. So you go to the location where your PSSC is installed and within that you go to the folder PSS pin and we simply copy this location. We come back here and we paste it. So basically, uh, either you copy or paste or you give the path where PSSC, a PSS bin is available for either it is version 33, 34 or 35. So you give uh, this path when I press enter. This path is saved in a, a variable known as PSSC. So next I'm going to include this path into system path. So sys dot path dot append. So I'm appending my new path, which is this PSSC into the system paths. Once I have included this path into my system path, now I need to include it into operating system environment or windows environment. So for this purpose, os.nviron and within this path, we need to in the existing, so in the existing path, we need to add my new path which is pssc path so once i press enter my path has been added into the operating system environment or windows environment now what i simply need to do is i need to call pssc as a library so the core function uh, or the core apis available within pssc are located in a, a library known as psspy so what i'm doing is i'm importing psspy so once i do this my uh, uh, psspy library is imported now what i simply need to do is i need to open pssc uh, within this python environment so for this i'm going to use psspy dot psse init so within uh, PSSPY module, there is a function known as PSSE INIT or in it, uh, this is going to initialize your PSSC outside your uh, GUI environment. So simply I'm uh, not passing any argument within this when I press and you see your PSSC version 32 because this was the version installed with me has been opened. Uh, within PSSC environment. So now whatever you used to do uh, from GUI you can do here and with additional capabilities of Python. Now this was uh, uh, a way to open uh, 30, version 33. Now you must have seen that I did a lot of step. I included my path and I had to import and included path into the environment. It may not be easy for everyone. So for this purpose, uh, I'm going to tell you about a library which can come in handy for you. 
so for this purpose just let me exit out of this uh, python environment so here i am back in my uh, command prompt or uh, this uh, uh, dos environment so now you simply need to do is simply write pip list because pip is something uh, uh, which is used to install new libraries new modules within your python environment so once i do pip list all the PSSC tools or all the PSSC modules which are available within my Python environment are going to. So I have included, I have added some more environment uh, or more uh, path as well, more modules as well. Um, it's totally up to you what you are using. So, but what I'm looking for here is this PSSC path. So what you need to do is if you do not, uh, usually if you have a fresh installation or you have never used PSSC uh, outside uh, uh, PSSC environment, or you have never used uh, PSSC from Python uh, environment, uh, you will not have this. So uh, how you can install this, you simply need to do pip install and PSSC. Once you press enter, this PSSC path um, is uh, going to be installed within your uh, pip environment within your python environment so uh, simply go on and install this once you have installed this now what we can do is we can use the capability of this module to call my uh, pssc uh, from python environment so how i can do this uh, so let me again go back to python so i am back into my python so here now, instead of calling OS and everything because I do not want to perform all these steps which are difficult, it is difficult to remember all this sys.path.append and everything. So I will simply import PSSC path. So this is the new module which I just installed. And within this module, there is a function PSSC path. So this is my module. Within this module, there is a function add underscore PSSC path. And all you need to do is uh, within the argument provide which version you want to call. If you only have one installation of PSSC, for instance, if you are only using version 33, no need to pass the argument. It will automatically open version 33 for you. Uh, if you only have version 34 available within your system, no need to pass the argument. It will automatically open uh, version 34 for you. But in my case, I have the uh, I have the uh, installation of version 33, 34, and 35. Therefore, I will be telling it which PSSC path I want to include in my environment. So I already told you how to do it for 33. So for 34, I will simply write 34 here. And when I press enter, so all these three, four steps, which I did uh, giving the path and then giving the uh, system path, appending the system path, then using the environment, it has already been taken care by this module. Uh, now, what I simply need to do is I need to import PSSPY. Once this is, I can open my PSSC now by simply writing PSSPY.PSSEINIT and so you see now instead of version 33 my version 34 has opened so anything i want to do within my pssc version 34 i am using it as an engine or whatever i will do now and i will ask python to call pssc so basically this time it will be calling version 34 to do all the tasks which are supposed to be done within pssc so for 35 as i told you let me just exit this. So for 35, as I told you, number one, uh, PSSC 35 is 64 bit. So it will come with uh, your uh, 30, uh, 34 bit Python also. So, and the Python used for this is 3.9. And secondly, uh, since it is 34 bit and Python 3, what you need to do is you need to call your Python 3 environment this time rather than Python 2 environment. So how you can call Python 3 environment uh, from you from the same uh, command window if you have two versions no problem don't worry about it now in this case simply write pi hyphen or dash minus three rather than minus two so now instead of uh, python 2 python 3 is going to be open uh, within your command prompt so once i press enter you will see this time python 3.9.13 has been opened rather than python 2.7.18 so 
uh, for uh, this version uh, you do not need to worry about this uh, adding uh, environments and everything because uh, for this version for version 35 pssc has already taken care of all these things so all you need to do is you simply need to write import pssc 35 and pssc is going to take care of all this uh, sys.path.append and everything no need to install additional module uh, to call uh, these kind of things once you do this your pssc environment has been added into your windows environment all you now simply need to do is you need to write import psspy so that you can call the core module and psspy dot pssce init and once you press enter now you are into your pssc 35 environment now so anything now you do now will be done with the help of pssc version 35